On narrowboats and barges, we all have a wood burner, which is the main heat source, wood and coal, and people choose another source to heat the rest of the boat. I stumbled on Kiasa just uh, on the internet because a friend told me that infrared heating was the most efficient way of using electricity to create heat. Um, and I just googled it and I started chatting with the guys and um, they were really helpful. So it's super efficient, unlike other systems that heat the air that you have to have running for hours, these you can have uh, coming on just before you need the room uh, because the infrared heats what it hits and not the air. I try to describe to friends that the, the, the heating panels, the infrared heating panels are like a solar panel but instead of the sun's rays hitting them and the, it giving you electricity, these you put the electricity in and it gives you the sun's rays. So you have this beautiful, uh, really nice warmth, like a, like a coal fire. I've got seven panels. The most important heater on the boat is the heating bar in the living room, because that means I can wake up to a warm living room every morning. The bathroom panels, you can turn on a quarter of an hour before you go in and even when it's zero degrees, you're walking into a warm room because the heat's hitting you. You're running a panel for 10 pence for an hour and uh, you're having a really amazing experience. Both bedrooms have a 600 watt panel which is 20 pence an hour and again, they're just needed for an hour before you go to bed if you like a warm bedroom. Well, the installation experience is so, super easy because you just put two or four screws into the wall and then you hang the thing and plug it in and it's ready to go. Uh, I only ever spoke to Kiaza and they were so helpful that, uh, that I didn't look elsewhere. So it just seemed that there was no other option really. Of course I'd recommend infrared heating and Kiaza for others, especially boat owners or people with small spaces um, that need heating or people with lots of different spaces and they don't need to heat them all at the same time. I mean, what's incredible is I built an old barge. Uh, it looks very retro and yet it's super high tech.